My name is Pedro Valente. I was born in Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. And I'm the professor, together with my brothers, I teach Jiu-Jitsu here at Valente Brothers. My first memories, I already was training Jiu-Jitsu. My grandfather trained, my father started when he was a young boy. And they started training me as soon as I was born. So I've been training Jiu-Jitsu all my life. When I arrived in the United States in 1993, I had nowhere to train. I had actually talked about that with my teacher and he recommended that I started teaching friends and that would be the way for me to continue my, my learning, my development. So I spent two months in the mountains of Rio and he prepared me to be a teacher. I took an instructor's course. So as soon as I arrived, Jimmy Robertson, who now runs Valente Brothers Coral Gamers, he was my roommate in college. And so he was my first student. I started teaching him and then other friends from the university. We started a club and more people wanted to learn and I, and I started teaching off campus as well. And then Horion Grace, who was the son of my teacher, he came to teach a seminar in South Florida. And he introduced me during that seminar as a Jiu Jitsu teacher. That number of, of private students grew and some of them wanted to train in a group class. So one of my students, he, he had a warehouse, his business, and there was some empty space. And he um, suggested that I start teaching group classes at his warehouse. And so that's what I started doing and that's how I started teaching off campus. And that was a difficult decision to, to teach Jiu Jitsu as a profession because I graduated from the University of Miami. And at that point I had to make a decision. Eventually I noticed that a lot of martial arts instructors were actually um, very successful and had a lot of students. And so I decided to, to do it myself because that's my passion. That's what I love doing. And eventually after two and a half years, we had so many students that then I decided to open a, an official school um, in Sunny Isles. And I partnered up with Jimmy who was already helping me in the warehouse. Um, and we partnered up and we did it together. Um, when we first started, we were following the model that we, was used in Brazil at the time, which was a model that combined self-defense and sport competition. Um, in fact, self-defense was not even taught in group classes, only in private classes. So everyone who came to the group class was only learning competition, grappling. But eventually I realized that there was a necessity for everyone to learn self-defense. And also I realized that the focus on sport would kind of kill people's interest in learning self-defense. So at one point we decided to focus exclusively on self-defense, which doesn't mean that we don't spar on the ground, but we always spar with a self-defense focus. Most importantly, we had to create a curriculum to teach the self-defense in a group format. We were pioneers in that, that was, had never been done before. And with Grandmaster Edo's approval and supervision, we did that, we created the first ever curriculum to teach the self-defense um, in a group format. The value that the Valente Brothers um, methodology brings to the community is the fact that we have the objective of preparing people for life. Yes, self-defense is important. And we believe that self-defense, when taught the right way, creates a lot of confidence. But we also teach a philosophy. It's a philosophy based, above all, in living life according to moral virtue, being a good person, living according to your values. This philosophy, we call it 753 Code, we organize it so that we can teach it to our students. It's something that to us is extremely important and beneficial to all the students who come to our school. I'm really proud that we work together with my brothers. We are three brothers and how united we are and then how that spirit of brotherhood and friendship translates to all the students who come here. And when you come to our mats, you really feel that positive energy. We built this facility because we feel that we wanted a structure that had the integrity that we present on our mats and that could represent as an architectural structure the depth and the greatness of the content of our classes and to continue to inspire our students as we are inspired by them promoting a healthy lifestyle, promoting wellness of the mind, of the body, and of the spirit.